Hi. Uh, I realize I haven't been on video for a long time, so I was inspired to do one based on fire because behind me, as you can see from this ray of sun across my face, um, the sun is shining brightly despite it being midwinter here in Cape Town. We do get these stunning days. So I'm just going to update you on my latest chemo journey. I had my chemo just over a week ago, last Thursday, and of course went into it with pretty major trepidation um, because of the first experience which was really, really difficult with my uh, digestive system just going crazy which is explained in a previous post. Um, this time I must say I went into it a lot more positive because I was finally given a treatment plan for this round of chemo. The doctors um, have suggested six chemos with a CT scan in the middle. We still don't know the extent of the disease. Um, my breathlessness is sorted after two chemos. So this is the lovely beach that I walk on and I am able to walk back at my normal speed, which has been such a treat. Um, so th the main thing which I really struggle with with chemo and post the week post chemo is, I don't know, there's just this, as if the joy has been sucked out of you. Um, for me, a big part of the joy in life is to be out in nature, but also I really enjoy good food and good healthy food, I realize, even though I sometimes don't eat very healthily. I'm starting to uh, really be grateful for the amazing food that is available, organic vegetables and wonderful fish and all the lovely things that that you can get fairly easily here um, so yeah and the taste is a huge one because what happens is your taste becomes pretty flat I can only describe it as that where even coffee which is one of my things I look forward to in a day just tastes completely flat to the point where you don't even want to drink it. Um, so that's a big joy that's out of my life for the week following chemo. And therefore your appetite goes because there's no joy in eating. Anyway, I'm through it. I had a wonderful lunch with my friend Saskia who helped me last time when I was really ill. She's an absolute magician with food and she just made this absolutely stunning vegan meal and we sat on her lovely sunny veranda overlooking this amazing view. So that's me. I'm doing pretty well. Look at these sweet kiddies on a little school trip on the beach behind me. And you may see some doggies coming into frame, but I think that's enough for today. And I've got the warmth of the sun on my back and it's a beautiful day. So being grateful for the simple things in life which are free. Thanks for listening. See you next time. Bye.